In today's video, we will be looking at Manga Mutiny, so stay tuned. My name is Zeke Matthew, and Anime Seat is for you who like original movies and series, as well as anime and manga reviews. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. It covers Genesis 1, and it takes us from creation to the fall of man, up to Moses departing from Egypt in Exodus 15. The art style is done by Ayo Azumi for the first three books. Each of the characters is drawn in the usual manga style, which gives it its unique flavor from other Christian comics. That is slightly more memorable, but a bit different. All the background draws you into the story, but unlike most manga, this one is fully colored. Pacing. This is where the manga does not do a good job, which I mean the stories of creation go way too quick, and by the time you get to know one of the characters, he or she dies and they introduce a new one. This manga covers a lot of material, but maybe too much at once. This could have been a tad slower to give a more memorable experience, to give each character more time and better explanation in other areas, and the sound effects are very well placed throughout the story. There is little fan service with no nudity and everything is censored very well with Adam and Eve talks about wives and has one scene with Jacob and Leah in bed but nothing is shown but it is implied. Unlike traditional manga where you read right to left, in this manga you can read left to right because it's easier on the American audience. Plus at the bottom of each page you have scriptures you can follow along in your own translation. This is a great manga of the Bible that tells the story of Genesis and teaches us about creation, where we came from, and Israel's history. I thoroughly enjoyed the manga myself. Even though the pacing is a little quick and could have been explained a little better, it's an excellent part one in the series if you're looking for a bible in manga format.